All right, I've been meaning to get to this one for a while. It's Far Cry 5. Uh, don't really need much of an introduction, I don't think. If you don't know what it is, you can just go to Google and type in Far Cry 5. Uh, I guess I can give you a quick explanation. It's a first-person open-world game. I think this one takes place in the Montana countryside. Uh, and yeah, you go around and... I think I already said it's first person and you go around and you fucking take out outposts and camps and stuff full of enemies and you claim those outposts and stuff and you find collectibles and all that stuff. I'm not sure how bad my load times are going to be considering I don't have this on my SSD right now. But it should be all right, hopefully. I don't know, this is taking a minute. Gotta look at these textureless freaks. It's like, they don't have skins, but they're wearing clothes. It's, I guess they just look like mannequins. Police mannequins. Which is kind of weird. I don't think I've ever seen a police officer mannequin before. How long is this load time going to take? How long am I going to have to sit here and talk about police mannequins? And this is already far, far too long. So I'm going to have to chop out some load times, I guess. Okay, so cut to whenever the game starts. Oh my god, this isn't the loading screen. <laughs> okay. Okay. That makes a whole lot more sense. You will be able to create your character again. Okay. Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. It was a goddamn cult. The lab is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. Government can't do shit. We're on our own. We save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Ow. Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see.
unfortunately still trying to talk some sense in our friend the Marshal. Over. Why am I so slow? Man, shit's gonna go bad real fast. I can already feel it. I mean, it's pretty obvious. <laughs> I'm gonna have to crank up my sensitivity. Go. 
God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see, step forward. And I saw. All right, so far so good. Everything's fine. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Marshal, take point. We're going right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. This is so fucked. Holy shit. Just fine, Jim. I don't need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. Unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. And we will take what we need. We will preserve what
what we have. <laughs> and we will kill all those who stand in our way. These, the harbingers of doom will see the truth. Okay. It was showing keyboard shit, and my fucking controls are like a mix of keyboard shit and not keyboard shit, so it's a little bit confusing right now. I don't know where I'm going, I don't know what's going on, but that whole intro was just cinematic as fuck. Okay, so far this seems like this is gonna be awesome. I feel like I'm getting away from him pretty good. Uh, I just don't really know where I'm supposed to be going or if there is like a set destination that I'm supposed to be running towards. Detection meter, yeah, I know how detection works. I was able to import my controls for Far Cry 3 and I think they're pretty much the same, at least for the way I had them set up. I'm surprised it worked because w with a lot of games when you're using the steam controller if you try to mix and match like for the trackpad I have a mouse on there and then for all the buttons I have a controller input controls a lot of games won't allow you to do that but Far Cry seems to be okay with it so oh my god what is this okay I got a big old pipe. I got a big old stick. I'm gonna fucking murder this guy. Why can't I? There we go. I'm trying to remember how the controls work a little bit because they keep freaking out a little bit and they're showing keyboard and then controller controls. But yeah, it's basically the same as how it was for Far Cry 4, so I like that. Oh yeah, all the buttons are the same. I, I'm guessing that these people are still chasing after me. But... Pretty confident in my ability. Oh, I thought this was going to be like a nice basement I could like fortify myself in. I don't know where I'm expected to go. They're running around looking for me though. It sounds bad. I'm just going to continue. Fuck, I, I'm getting closer to him, it sounds like. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, man. Maybe it's just their voices I can hear. Maybe they're not actually going to show up over here next to me. How do I get through here? Oh, here we go. This is something, I think. Yeah. I hear gunshots. That's not good. Hello. Anyone here with me? Hello? It's Burke. Burke? I think I lost him. I see a detected trailer here. Fucking ammo, fuck you guys. Can I loot them too? I probably just alerted everybody to my presence, but I'm gonna be on the move. Oh fuck. I thought I was gonna be on the move. Oh god. I was like, I'm just gonna get right out of here. It's gonna be fine. Nobody's close to me. It was not the case.
Supposed to meet somebody. They're coming. Oh, there are quite a few of them, too. So I'm just going to not be near them. Over here on the other side, I guess. They got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. This is going to be the part where I think I have a nice ally, and then he's going to get killed, like, in the next two minutes or something. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. F fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, we gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it. We're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh. Oh shit, I wasn't ready. I need to change like all of my settings and all my sensitivities. I you shouldn't even be out there, you fucking idiot. Why are you here? God damn, man. You're going to get me killed. You're going to get me killed. Why don't you just stop being an idiot? I guess I can't go back through that door. All right. I don't know if that's really all that much better or not, but it should be at least a little bit better. It kind of is. I'm going to be dead. Is he... In a car? Where the fuck? Oh. Hey! 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 Fucking asshole. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. I need to tweak. Okay, dude, but I gotta tweak my sensitivity, so stop talking for a second. Oh no, what? Okay. Oh god. Wasn't expecting to have to reload right there. Reload faster! Oh, there he goes. Why am I so close to being dead? You need to learn how to drive faster, dude, or just let me drive. Trying to lean out the window. I'm just fucking dead. Case of dynamite in the back? How do I get it? Press something to throw. Oh. Yeah, I wanted to kill these guys, you know, because they're right there. I'm so fucking dead. This is just a shit show. Okay. I 
Oh, is he alive still? I fucking lit that dude up. Holy shit, that guy had a rocket launcher, I think. All right. Jesus. I have more dynamite, I think. This is just fucked. Watch out for the cows. Okay. Okay. Jesus. Well, I tried. I fucking shot him so many times. Just be dead. Oh. I think this is probably copyrighted music. I'm probably gonna have to turn it off. Cause I'm gonna get hit with a YouTube thing for this one probably. I would imagine. that shit means it means the roads have all been closed it means the phone lines have been cut it means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley but mostly it means we're all fucked <sighs> goddamn collapse they all think the world's coming to an end now They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. Fuck. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. Some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. All right, a glimmer of hope. Oh, character creation. Oh, wow. Alright, so they didn't have a whole lot of options, but, uh... 
this is what I ended up with after picking my base character. And then they had like three skin options and then some hairstyles to pick from, but most of them kind of fucking just sucked. All right, so I picked my character and then I picked my clothes and then now I think I might be done with it. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. All right, so what does Dutch have to say to me? What's it? I suppose. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. The little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's gotta be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're gonna do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. So, I just went in and turned off the music because I was like, man, there's probably a lot of copyrighted music and stuff playing, like this song playing in the background. And like, I just, I turned it off, but the fucking music is still playing. <laughs> I guess the only way I can turn it off is to actually go over there and fucking turn it off. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. Alright. Alright, so how the hell do I get out of this bunker? Where's the exit? I'm ready to go do a couple of things. What's this? A shovel? Okay, thanks for the weapon wheel tutorial, I guess. There it is, the weapon wheel. That, and I can't use it. I literally cannot use the weapon wheel. <laughs> okay, I've got that figured out at least. Alright, so maybe now I should leave the bunker. Why do I only have ten bullets? Or like six, or I, I can't even count those, they're so small. Yeah, I think there's six of them. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people. We might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. Third. You can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those places will give the resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. Alright then. set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Dutch out. Alright. Liberate Dutch's Island. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. That's cool. A little sneaky splinter cell guy. Is that it? Just three of them? Because I can handle that no problem. Do a quick pop, pop, pop. Pop. 
Pop. Pop. Oh, pop. No, I punched him. Punching was not enough. Okay. Punching like four times was enough. Stop with the tutorials. Only give me the ones that I need. Okay, um, more ammo, please. I need it. Desperately. Alright, so I took those guys out. Got a little bit of ammo now. Oh, yep. Yeah, I sure do. Things are getting a little weird every so often, and I don't know if it's because I'm using mouse and keyboard and controller. Like I'm seeing like a weird little jitter every so often. I don't really know how to explain it. I don't really like it, though. I ran the benchmark before I started and everything was fine. Anyway, um, I think I'm supposed to shoot this thing. Yep. I sure was. I sure was. Let's just, uh... Get rid of this here. Nobody needs to know about that. And now he's disposed of. Nobody will ever find him. <laughs> Anyways, uh, okay. So I took care of that little spot right there. And, uh, I beat the game. I did it. Oh, wait a second. No, oh, never mind. Now I beat the game. This is what I want to do for the rest of the game. Nobody can find me in here. Then I can bust out of here and then be like, rah. But I guess I can't, though. Uh, what's this? Some casing and some fasteners. Dig this guy a grave. And I can stop stalling and figure out what to go do next. Is that where I came from? Ooh, Johnson Lookout Tower. Alright, so I tweaked a couple of settings. I'm not really sure what's going on, but... I'll have to look into things a little bit more before I do the next one. So what is this place all about? I might just have to relaunch the game. Okay. I've restarted the game. Everything seems to be running much, much, much smoother now. But anyways, there's that spot I was just at like a couple minutes ago, I think. Liberate civilian. They were right behind me. I didn't even see them. I just like, oh, yes, I can. All right. That takes care of that mess. Where's the body? Okay, I got some ammo. Where? Okay, there you are. Dynamite, 50 cal ammo. Do I already have that gun? Am I not able to pick it up? Oh. Hold on, dude. I'm not ready yet. All right, what's up? Congratulations, you're a free man. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Oh wow. Prepper stash. I just saw the cult grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Okay. Looks like they're giving me some stuff to do. I'm kind of sort of running out of time for this one, but I'm glad I got everything working smoothly. And then, uh, 
can try to knock out at least one of these missions or I don't know maybe I'll just roam around and liberate some more areas or something I don't know do I have anything on my map yeah I got a prepper stash on my map I would love to just like place a waypoint on it there we go cool yeah I can see myself playing a good bit of this I mean it's Far Cry I basically knew what to expect but I'm liking it so far oh I gotta get up here to use the zip line use the zip line oh this is cool again it's Far Cry I don't know why I would uh, expect anything different I don't know why I would expect there to not be zip lines Underground stash with a pipe for a proper Huh. How do I. Okay. Fuck, kid. You hit pay dirt. That's the location of a prepper stash. If you can find your way inside, there's usually a bunch of useful shit that's been squirreled away. Well, go take a look. Inside? I can do that. I can do that easy. Wow, everything looks so great. I mean, it looks less great than it did before I turned off the HD textures, but at least it's running at a constant smooth uh, 60. I didn't even notice there were fucking other guys over here. Or, they're not fucking other guys over here, but... There are other guys over here. Let's see here, I've got a pretty good angle on him. Is it just the one? I feel like there'd be more than one. Got his back to me. Okay, I see you there too. I don't want to kill the fucking innocent guy though. So I'm going to go down and around, bring it around town, get a better angle. Okay, yeah, this is a much better angle, and I'm closer to the other person when I have to take them out. Who's doing it, huh? Who's doing it? Who's responsible for this? I wonder. I wonder who's going to be the one who's going to get their ass kicked. Fuck you, I fucking hit her in the head with a shovel. <laughs> I didn't really expect that. Oh, I will. Just uh, give me a second here. Look at all these guns. This is great. Got a grenade. You're liberated. You have anything to say? Maybe like a nice quick thank you and maybe not shooting me? I can hire you? Does that mean you follow me now or you... He's in my squad. Hey, deputy. Now that you're part of huh. the you should head to the forest research station. Ghosts been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. Well, I don't want this guy to follow me around. I mean, it's cool that you can do that, but on a sign. Maybe he doesn't follow me around. Maybe he's just like... Some dude I can ask for help. Oh no, he does follow me around. I don't really want him to. Yeah, I'm just gonna tell him to not. Thanks for your help, dude. It's been real cool. Wait, what? Ready in... Minute and fifty. What? If you need. Oh, okay. So he's available if I ever want help from him again. That's cool. Oh yeah, I was gonna try to get into that fucking boathouse. The boathouse, boys. Am I even going the right way? What is he doing? Don't go take my treasure, that's what I was gonna do. 
stealing my idea. At least he tested the water, so I know it's safe. Fucking hope it's safe. Let's see, what would be in the water in Montana? I can't think of anything too spooky, but I also am not a wildlife expert. Ooh, a key. This is cool. Um, Getting lots of stuff. That's always nice to get some stuff. I can't search this. How can she slap? I can punch this guy's pictures. And uh, can I look in here? What if I do one of these? Uh. All right, well, that was a sort of successful thing there, I guess. I'm gonna go back over this way and see if it provided me with any good results. Do I open this? Okay. Excuse me, I thought I activated the pump, you know, so I, so all this water would be done. It just, you know, wouldn't be a thing anymore. Where's my fucking oxygen meter? My guy is starting to sound really unhappy. Is this going down at all? There's gotta be something that I'm missing. Oh, I have to activate it, maybe? There we go. Oh, yeah. Some nice clean water. Some nice flood water. Make everything real nice. Oh, there's a toilet down here. I didn't know. What is this? Oh, it's just another melee. Uh. How do I... What? How do I get through there? Excuse me? There we go. I got arrows. I got sunken funds complete. Fasteners. Oh, I got two jars full of fasteners. If you're looking to make a bigger impression, you may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. Just grab them up. Get crafting. Got some wet money. My loot is full. What? Craft things and stuff. And things and stuff. Weapon wheels, select a slot, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'll figure that out some other time. Was that it for this? I see a bow. I don't really know that I want to replace anything. Huh. Yeah, that's tough. I don't really know that I want to do that. Reach the forest research station. I'm curious though, can I craft in my menu or do I have to do it like by opening up my weapon wheel? Roster inventory. Yeah, I bet I can do it in here somewhere. I will figure that out later. Guns for hire. So I wonder how big this map is. It looks like I'm just on like a tiny little island right now. But I'm assuming eventually it'll zoom out more because if this is just like it. No, that's not it. That's like so fucking small, but yeah, I go over here to the mainland at some point, I imagine. And I assume it zooms out a lot more. I don't know. Oh shit, okay, that's right, I've gotta take out these guys. Okay, well, um... Huh. I see a few explosive barrels. Can't I? Oh yeah, I can just do this. 
And I can mark all these fucking guys. That guy has a barrel. I wonder if the barrels they have are explosive. I see like a red like diamond on them that kind of makes them look dangerous. Let's put this away so that I can fucking try to shoot some of these barrels. Distraction! That didn't seem to do as much as I had hoped. I, did, I don't have any good cover right now. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. I have the high ground. It's over. Did he just throw a grenade up here? You don't get to pick him up, but you did, I guess. All right, well, that was uh, successful. I hope not. Uh... What? Is there somebody else? Why would you say that? Do something. Anything. Nobody is alive. Watch. E. Everything's fine. I will, just, I have to show you how safe everything is first, by smashing all these windows. Please. Man, thank you. Seriously. Okay. No problem. Uh... Alright. So that was a nice, successful liberation of a small little camp place, I guess. Unfortunately, I'm out of time. What the fuck is happening? What's going on? Why am I all like... Oh, I was... Standing on that? Oh, that's like their weird, like, drug, I guess. Yeah. Anyways, uh, don't do drugs. Drugs are bad, okay? Um. <laughs> I was like, why are there little sprinkly... Oh, okay, that's not what they are. Little sparkles just going around. Yeah, why are there sprinkles all over my screen? Who's eating ice cream down here by my fucking TV and got sprinkles all over it? But yeah, alright, anyways, uh, that's gonna be about it for this first one, uh, whatever this is. My Far Cry 5 playthrough, I guess. Uh, next time I will get off Tutorial Island and then, uh, hopefully get into some of the main chunks of the game. So yeah. Fucking... Can I knock this over? Oh, I, I did it. Now it's just gonna go everywhere. Oh, I can I can pollute the water supply with it. How do I kick it? Okay, that's gonna take way too long. Alright, so until next time then. Mm -hmm.